so this is 3188 PCB. What's going on here? Well, we are manufacturing the uh, RK3188 uh, mini PC. So, where are we now? Well, we are in Shenzhen. Uh, this company is Suilin, uh, uh, Fulin. Fulin. Fulin uh, Electronic. Um, here today we are manufacturing 500 pieces of uh, mini PC. See, this is uh, the design house, and uh, we uh, have it manufacturing here. Uh, we have the expert here, they are expert of uh, SMT. So uh, you can see this is uh, SMT production line. Can we start uh, here? Mm -hmm. This is the first step. And uh, in the first step, um, we put in uh, this um, PCB in, into this machine. So this machine is just like a printing machine. You can see uh, there's uh, some holes uh, in the paint. And when we put in this uh, PCB underneath, and then this machine will put the fax, F-L-U-X, fuse onto, onto the disk surface, just like painting. And push uh, the foot uh, fuse uh, through the holes. Okay. And this morning, we have already done the first side. Yeah. Yeah. Now we do this side. And, so how uh, long does it take? How long does it take? Yeah. Uh, you mean uh, manufacturing 500 pieces? You, you, you did this morning, and now you do the afternoon. Well, it's almost uh, 11 hour or 12, uh, 15 hours. You do 500 okay. pieces? Yeah. You well, we can compare uh, what, what it look like. You can see these two pieces. And their color is different. So uh, the upper one got the, uh, got the fuse uh, on it. So you can see uh, the, the orange uh, color turns into white color. So it's covered with uh, the sticky um, fuse. It's, um, this fuse uh, doesn't have the LED, L-E-A-D, uh, because it's uh, environmental friendly. So it's more expensive to manufacture. The gold one? Ah, yeah. Is this gold? No, it's, uh, oh, they got silver in it. So it's not gold, but they got silver. So the silver, what is he doing? Well, he's uh, inspecting uh, whether this uh, PCB have all the fields uh, covered up. That means to make sure each pawn have the fields. Okay. So this is the mini PC, which is your product. Yeah. Mini PC. Why mini PC? Well, I think uh, this is uh, a new market, and uh, it will be um, have a lot of uh, functionality, and uh, people enjoy using it. And I think after the smartphone, tablet. Mini PC will be the third major market for the ARM uh, chipset. So what's going on here? It looks violent. Wow, uh, you see uh, it's uh, putting in the IC on it, the small IC. Um, and we will see another machine with the similar function. But uh, the one will put in the bigger ICs. Right, right now it's just uh, put in the small pieces, so you don't see any uh, big IC on it. So it's a really fast machine. You can see many, uh, in each uh, step, it will put on one IC on it. All right. This is the expert guy doing that. Yeah, this guy is the expert. <laughs> right. Yeah. So this is the second uh, machine, which will put on the, the bigger IC, like the RK3188. So, so putting the processor. yeah, you can see yeah this one. Oh, just get it. <laughs> you miss it. <laughs> okay, see this is um it put in the bigger IC. The DDR and flash will be uh, and the RK thirty one AK will be put on this uh, process. Is it precise? Yeah, very precise. And uh, this computer will have a have a uh, optical sensor on it to check if uh, the process is done uh, correctly and the IC is put on the right position. All right. So okay. What is she doing? 
Well, this is uh, a manual process. You see, um, there are some uh, missing parts here. They will put on like this part, will, they, they will put on the HDMI and the micro USB. Because um, this one have to um, like um, uh, pinch, pinch on on it. See this, uh, the hole have to be uh, push through. So that's why uh, this part is a manual process. So after did that, uh, this part, almost all the IC and its connector are put on the, the PCB board. They mainly put on the, the connector, like uh, the HDMI, uh, micro USB, H, uh, USB, and the headphone jack. This part is very important because uh, it's a manual process. Where does it go next? Well, it goes to the, like something like the oven to the oven. heat it up. Yeah, you can see this, uh, the temperature. Uh, 130, 140, 160, this is the temperature. And uh, this is uh, the mini PC. It push through this uh, uh, oven. I don't know its, uh, it's, uh, it's official name. It's just like heat up uh, the, the, the whole pieces to make it firmly attached to the PCB. So it's cooking? Yeah, something like the cooking. You, you can see this uh, fancy cooker. All right, why? For what? Oh, to, you know the IC is just uh, with, uh, put on the PCB. It needs the heat to fuse, uh, fuse, the, fuse FLUX and the IC and the board, three part fill together. So it's firmly attached. All right. All right, see this is a fancy cooker. Yeah. So this part is, um, uh, the official name is um, uh, AOL, Automatic um, Optical Inspector. See, when, when he got the PCB, uh, the mini PC out of the, the oven, and he put on the, the, this machine. This machine will do a comparison to compare the the finished product, the OK product, against this uh, newly made product to make sure the IC in the right spot, right uh, right uh, position. So it can inspect, uh, inspect like a uh, very tiny, um, tiny uh, position like uh, um, this small IC or uh, the foot pin of this. Uh, uh, fresh, so it's really a uh, precise machine. Can you show it again? This one, show, show, the, show this. Okay. So, so right here you have two, uh, two devices, right? Yeah. So, what happens after? What happen? Uh, what happen after? Um, after this inspection, um, this girl will load the uh, load the program into the mini PC. Like loads of uh, Android? Yeah, you see, uh, this uh, can load maximum eight mini PC, but now he, she's uh, loading only two. See, uh, there are two here with one PC. So right. if, if in a mass production, it can load many, many eight right. pieces in one time. And is this it? After this is done or what? Well, it's uh, not completely done, but the uh, SMT process is finished. Then we will go through another assembly and testing process. This process will be completely manual. So uh, this part, I think is 80% uh, done. Then we will go through the next uh, assembly and testing, which will be another 20% of the work. So this is your RK3188 quad core rock chip, 28 nanometer mini PC on a mini PC. Mini PC, yeah. How many you sell? Well, so far, uh, several thousand. And uh, how big is it going to be? Is it going to be bigger than Windows? Wow, I hope so. <laughs> All right, mm -hmm. cool. Yeah. So how is it different compared to the dual core? Well, uh, it's more stable, and uh, the temperature of the 
uh, the, the device is lower and it's more stable, quicker, and uh, you can feel it. And uh, once you click it, and the program will just pop up, and uh, the browsing speed is amazing. I think it's awesome. With that price, uh, just uh, uh, $20 more than the, the uh, dual core one, I think the quad core is uh, the, uh, the best choice right now. Are people uh, pre-ordering? Yeah, uh, we have sold uh, some. Uh, we, right now, we have a pre-order of our second batch. And the, in the second batch, we have 500. Later on, we will may have uh, 700 or a uh, 1.4 uh, uh, K uh, in the next batch. So at the end, you just do assembly? Yeah, do assembly testing. I think the testing is the most important part to make sure every um, connector is working and the Wi-Fi should work uh, fast enough and, uh, and it can function uh, properly. So it, this is uh, one of the strengths for us because we are really concerned on the, on the quality and the performance. So we make sure every pieces we, uh, we sell uh, up to our standard.